Yeah, so now I've got my, uh, got my cakes, got my, uh, got my barm cakes, finger rolls, back to the arcade now, drop this lot off. And then I've got to switch my van back to my car. So I'll go and grab my car. And then that's it for today with the, with the driving. Well, anyway, we're at Spang Corner now. Spang Corner, it's a, it's a major crossroads in Blackpool. This is where a lot of uh, busy roads meet. You've got uh, Northside Lane, Ansdell Road, Waterloo Road, and Martin Drive. They all meet at this, at this, this, this one junction. Um, Yeah, very very busy junction this one and it's a bit of a bugger sometimes when you get stuck on it it can be uh, it can be quite a long wait sometimes at this junction they're on Ansdell Road now heading down towards Grasmere Road Grasmere Road will have connect to Central Drive and so on just showing you a little bit of the back streets now Bloomfield pub there on my right hand side now called the Bloomfield Brew House and this is the junction with Bloomfield Road of course Hansdell Road Bloomfield Road Junction so if you were to swing a left here which we're not that'd take you down to the football ground we're going straight on Across this junction, it's onto Grasmere Road. Oh, and now the rain's coming down quite heavy. That's just what I don't need when I'm getting cakes out the back of the van. Gotta try and keep them covered. Okay, now onto Grasmere Road. And there's the tower bang ahead of us. The sky's full of rain today. There's not a break in them clouds. I think we're in for a in for a wet one today. It's done nothing but rain for the last oh, couple of weeks now. We've had loads of rain. We'll probably get a hose pipe banned tomorrow. <laughs> Okay, now we're going to join on to Central Drive here. This is where Grasmere Road joins Central Drive. I'll take it really easy around this roundabout because I've got a lot of cakes in the boot. I don't want them rolling about with a cream everywhere. Central Drive. This is where I was brought up and it's a right mess now. Used to be a lovely, lovely shopping street this back in the day when I was a kid. Bustling it was, full of, full of, full of vibrant energy. Now, oh my God, what a state. It, it's, uh, it's quite heartbreaking to see it like this, to be honest with you. Well, I suppose this is the same in a lot of towns now. And small businesses are folding left, right, and centre. You've got more corner shops and barbers than you can. I, I, why is there so many bloody barbers? That's what I want to know. How many people, how many barbers do you need? 
leave that one to your imagination. How many barbers? There's more barbers than I could mention on this street. International food shops and barbers. We're on Chapel Street now. I'm just turning in behind my place uh, and then to offload all the stock once more. Pretty quiet down here, to be fair. Don't think I'm going to be in, a, in that big a rush to open today. Very, very quiet, in fact. Not surprised with the weather, though. the cakes all in just had to dodge the rain dodge the spots cakes are in and the fresh pies are in the fresh finger rolls everything fresh there you go we're rocking and rolling ready to go today now got my dough balls ready for my pizza and now I can go and switch my car get switch to my car get back and get open catch you later viewers our park just gone about to go in the arcade and look what's there that big bloody yellow van he's there Come to infiltrate me. No longer have a Higgit free zone. Look. It's what I have to put up with every morning. Every single morning is here. The Higgit. The Higster. The Higster Mobile. Where is he? Look, look, you'd think it was this place, wouldn't you? He just comes in, makes himself at home, uses my Wi-Fi, he drinks me coffee. Okay, with all due I've been on, everywhere this morning, don't even say it. The reason I'm here is because I've done your stock shopping for you. Not my stock shopping. I've had to fetch gammon, I've had to fetch Nutella, I've had to fetch salad. I don't even know where half this stuff is. I spent all my time in the warehouse. Looking Where's my at coffee? What? You come in, made yourself a coffee, and you didn't get me one. I got one of your bitches to make me a coffee. Which bitch made him a coffee? His daughter. All right. Thanks. I need a coffee. I've had a, I've had a heavy morning. So viewers, there you have it. Been up since the crack of dawn, and here comes my first coffee of the day. I've nearly done a full day's work already. While this, before this crack got out of the shower. There's more work in a doctor's sick though. I get out of the shower, I'm told by the wife, your stalk is being on the phone to you. I can't, <laughs> can't even get out of the shower and the phone's going off. Ugh.